Welcome back to 8 News at 4. I'm Eric Phillips. And I'm Heather Hope. And tonight's Positively Richmond, we're taking a look at a new exhibit featuring immersive sculptures. It's now open at Lewis Ginter Botanical Garden. Encanto, an oasis of lyrical sculpture, features artwork by Burning Man artist Kate Roddenbush. 8 News anchor Delaney Hall has a sneak peek. Five new sculptures now tower over Lewis Ginter Botanical Garden. Here to tell us more about Encanto, an oasis of lyrical sculpture, is Beth Ann Booth. Thanks for joining us. Thank you for being here. It's very exciting. Can you tell us a little bit about these uh, massive works of art? So they are quite massive, but they are all very <laughs> symbolic and connecting with human nature and the actual natural world as well. So they're extremely intricate, but at the same time, they're abstract as well. So, And the artist meant for them to be an immersive experience. So what does that exactly mean? The artist's intention is for the guests to connect with the art itself, but also have this deeper takeaway and meeting them where they are at. And so physically it's immersive, but at the same time we want people to respect the art and know that it's art. We're not in a gallery <laughs> setting, but it is you know, it's fine art and there are precious materials involved as well. And the process to even get them here to the garden has been a couple years, right? Yes, yes. it was a multi-year um, co-production working with Kate <laughs> very intimately. Um, and then also the, the poet, Shaw Michelle, uh, she um, has poetry that is in dialogue with these sculptures too. Um, but, you know, Kate came out to the garden and uh, felt called and each of these pieces was designed with this space in mind. And so you'll see the various sculptures in their setting and how they really do fit hand in hand. It is a good space. I hear birds chirping. I yes. hear water, right? Very relaxing. Yes. And you guys also have something fun coming up on Fridays. Yes, yes. So the second Friday of each month from May through September, we've partnered with Gallery 5 and they're going to be bringing a different themed event um, every second Friday of the month. So this Friday we have um, an Encanto evening of fire. Mm. And so PLF is going to be at the garden doing fire performance, DJs, etc. Um, so these these sculptures, again, they, they have light in them. So they're all, you can experience them all at night as well. But we're excited to have these evening hours and events with partners and these experiences that are really going to engage community. Very cool. There's a lot to see for yes. sure. Well, you can check out the exhibits. They are included with regular garden admission and they do run through the end of October. So you do have some time to check it out. For more information, you can head to our website, WRC.com. And for now, I'll see you in Good Morning Richmond starting at 430.